Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, Sebastiana, Ursula, Cindy, Grisia, Mirna. How are you doing today? How was your day? It was good. Was I, yeah, I was working. Okay, working. Okay. Uh, for how many hours do you work? So, Stana. Um, I worked eight hours, eight or ten hours. Okay. Yes. It is um. Yeah, long time. You had to start uh, from 8 a.m. or from 9 a.m., from 9 to 5? Mm, no, it's from 7, uh, 7 a.m., uh, sometimes uh, to 4 or 3. Okay. That is good. From Monday to Friday. Um, Saturday too. Saturday too. Okay. Yes. <laughs> but Saturday just from from eight to twelve. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. Okay. Let me let me okay open my presentation. Here we have it. Hmm. Okay. Can you see it? Yes, I do. Okay. Can you see it? Uh when we ask the question, can you? You can say yes, I can. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Welcome, everyone. Well, we're going to start. Okay, because it's it's nine three. So just I have nine students, but we're going to start. So a uh, welcome to the class number sixteen. Okay. Um. For today, we're going to continue um, speaking about daily activities using the present continuous and WH equations. The, the main objective for today is that you identify vocabulary for discussing different activities that we're doing at home, okay, or that we make. Okay. Well, thank you so much for your attendance, everyone. Maybe because it's the last class, maybe some of your classmates that don't want to, to be here. I don't know. But thank you so much for because you are here, okay? I really appreciate it. Okay, we have a paragraph here that is an easy paragraph that we that I want that we complete. We have here the options at the left. Um, I want that we complete that options that we have. For example, in the first space, hello, my name is is is. Let me change the color, maybe green. Uh, my name is uh -huh, John. I usually get up. Get up. I usually get up at seven o'clock in the morning. Okay, in the morning. Mm 
Mm -hmm. I brush. I brush. Okay. My teeth and take a shower. Okay. And take a shower. What is that option? Or have, have a shower. shower. Have, uh -huh. a shower. have a shower. Have a shower. Then I get dressed. Mm -hmm. I get dressed. I have breakfast. Okay. I have. I have breakfast in the kitchen with my parents and my brother. Huh? At a. A.M. Uh -huh, A.M. I go to school. School. I go to school. Okay. By bus. Uh huh. I always. Do my homework. Mm. Yeah, that can be one option. But after school, what will be the next activity? The next, uh, what what you can do when you are back from school. <laughs> Have lunch. Mm -hmm. Have lunch. At home. Huh? In the afternoon. Okay. In the afternoon. Very good. I. Do my homework. Okay, very good. I do my homework. I'm sorry because that, the space. I do my homework and after I do sports. Mm -hmm. I do sports with my friends at the park. After I got home in the night. In? In the night. The night. The night. Okay, the night. I have dinner. Have dinner. I have dinner with my family at seven o'clock p.m. Uh, uh -huh, at go to bed at seven. Mm -mm. Maybe go to bed will be at night. 
At nine. Again. Mm, okay. Well, in that, yes, in that case, here will be different. What will be there? Evening. Evening, right? Mm -hmm. But I have to, I have to. Okay, I go to bed. I go to bed at night thirty. PM. PM. Okay, that was good. Very good. Who wants to read the complete paragraph? Mm -hmm. Volunteers? Who wants to read that paragraph? Okay, Cindy. Hello, my name is Cindy. I usually get up at seven o'clock in the morning. I brush my teeth and have a shower. Then I get dressed. I have breakfast in the kitchen with my parents and my brother. At 8 a.m., I go to the school by bus. I always have lunch at home. In the morning, I do my homework and after I do sports with my friends at the park. After I go home in the evening, I have dinner with my family at 7 o'clock p.m. At night, I go to bed at 9.30 p.m. Okay, very good. Here is a mistake in the brave past. Why the correct spelling? Mm -hmm. What will be the correct spelling of brave pass? Brave. Mm -hmm. B R E A K F A S T. Okay, yes, good. Very good. Who else wants to read that? ¿Qué más lo quiere leer? That was very good, Cindy. Okay, Ursula. Hello, my name is John. I usually get up at 7 o'clock in the morning. I brush my teeth and I have a shower. Then I get dressed, I have breakfast in the kitchen with my parents and my brother. At 8 a.m., I go to school by bus. I always have lunch at home. In the afternoon, I do my homework and after I do a sport with my friends at the park. After I go home in the evening, I have dinner with my family at 7 o'clock p.m. at night. I go to bed at 9.30 p.m. Okay, that was excellent. Thank you so much. Okay. Sebastiana, do you want to participate? Yes. Okay. Okay. Um, hello, my name is John. I usually get up at 7 o'clock in the morning. I brush my teeth and have a shower. Then I get dressed. I had breakfast in the kitchen with my parents and my brother. At 8 a.m., I go to school by bus. I always have lunch at home. In the afternoon, I do my homework. And after I do sport with my friends at the park. After I go home in the evening, I have dinner with my family at 7 o'clock p.m. At night, um, and I go to bed at 9.30 p.m. Yes, 
Okay, was good. Thank you so much, Sebastiana. Okay, do you have questions about this? Do you understand everything, right? Yes, good. Okay, do you think that you can do, you can write a paragraph like this? ¿Piensan que ya pueden escribir un párrafo como este? Yes. Okay, sí, está, está, bien, está bien fácil. So, it is about the activities that you do every day. Okay. Okay, let me just... Do just erase everything because okay <clears throat> okay activities we have more activities here that we usually do right every day okay if we use the present continuous how we are going to make the sentences for example the first one she is reading the news. Reading the news. Okay. Okay. What about her? He's she or he, is he or she? He, <laughs> it seems like he. he, he okay. <laughs> he is taking, he is taking, taking all, all the, the rubbish. Okay, yes. he's taking out the rubbish. Okay. What about this one? It is his whipping. Mm -hmm. The floor. The floor, okay. It is raking. Raking, raking the leaves. The leaf. Okay. What about her? Is ironing, 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 the clothing, the clothes. Okay. What is dust? It is dusting. Dusting the house. The house. Okay. Do you know what is that? The meaning? Do you know what is that? Does, yeah. does. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. What about this one? It is cleaning the window. It's cleaning. Okay. It could be she's cleaning the window. Okay. What about he? This? It is cutting. It's cutting. cutting the grass. Cutting the grass. Okay. Yeah. What was the other way that we learned yesterday about, about this? It was the same. Mowing the land, right? Or we can say cutting the grass. Okay. Okay, what about this? It is doing. Doing. doing the dishes. The dishes. Okay. If you have to, tiene que lavar los platos. So you will say do, okay? Do the ditches or doing the ditches, okay? No, it's make, it's do. Mm -hmm. In this case, it's do. Okay, what about this? It is painting. Painting the painting. house. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. It is holding the laundry. It's falling. Holding the laundry, it is when cuando se dobla la ropa, okay? That is fold. Okay. Surf the net. He is surfing the net. Surfing the net. Teacher, mm -hmm. entonces eso es tipear también. O, o qué es? Teclear. Surf es Nave navegar, navegando. Navega. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, feed the dog. Feeding? Feeding the dog. Feeding. Mm -hmm. He is walking the dog. Walking the dog. Mm -hmm. 
is taking a taxi. Taking a taxi. She is waiting for the bus. Waiting for the bus. The bus. Uh huh. What about this one? He's painting. He's painting. Painting the picture. The picture. Mm -hmm. What about him? He's phoning people. Phoning people. You can say also phoning. You can say call, calling, or you can say phoning. Okay. Se pueden ambos. It's mm -hmm. the same word, phone and call. Phone, is, it, it works like a verb and also like a noun. Mm -hmm. Por eso lo podemos hacer, phoning, okay? Okay. Okay, we have another activities here. Do the laundry. She is? She is doing, doing, the doing the laundry. Okay. We're going to repeat that one. Iron. She is? Ironing. 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 She is ironing the process. Okay. Hang. She is? Hanging. Hanging the clothes. Okay. Vacuum. She is? Vacuuming. Vacuuming the floor. Okay. Exercise. She is exercising. exercising. Yeah, okay, that can work like a verb and like a noun too. Okay. Go out with a friend. Um, they are going 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 out with a friend. With friend. Mm -hmm. She is. Playing, playing the guitar. Playing the guitar. Okay, very good. What about her? She is? She's taking, 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 taking pictures. Taking pictures. And she is? Going. Going. Shopping. Going. Shopping. Okay. Okay. Watering. Watering the plant. Watering the plant. Okay, water, it also works like a verb and like noun. Like a verb, we can say watering, watering the plant. Okay. Okay, very good. Did you learn new ones? ¿Sí aprendieron nuevos? Yes? Yes. Yes. Okay, yes. Take, take note. If, if one is new for you, Take notes, okay? Dust. Mm -hmm. Or maybe rake. You. Fold, maybe it's new for you. Surf. Surf. Okay. Phone. And phone. You didn't know that it's it, it can be a verb. Yeah. Hang. Maybe Making. that is new. Make bacon. Mm -hmm. Water. Water. Watering. Okay. Okay, we have a conversation here. Who wants to participate? Mm -hmm. Volunteers? Okay, Ursula and Mildred, go ahead. Empiezo yo. Mm -hmm. Yay. Yeah. Look at the the image. The, okay. Look at the image. Where are they? I seems they are in the house. What are they celebrating? 
They are celebrating Christmas. What are they doing? They are taking pictures. What are they waiting? They are wearing Christmas hats. What else are they wearing? They are wearing pajamas and jeans. Also, also they have Christmas blanket. Are they happy? Yes, yeah. they are. It's Christmas night. Okay. Very good. Okay, it is missing a letter T here. They are. Do you think that I they are using pajamas? Pajamas? Sweaters, maybe, right? Or do you think that it, those are pajamas? Yo si uso pijama y no te buena, Yes. Sí. Okay. It could be. Okay. Who else wants to read that? Volunteers to read that paragraph. Okay, Sebastiana and who else? Mildred already participated, right? Okay, uh, Rocio, go ahead. Yes. Look at the image, where are they? It seems they are in a house. What what are they celebrating? They are celebrating Christmas. What are they doing? They are taking pictures. What are they wearing? They are wearing Christmas Christmas hats. What else are they wearing? They are wearing pajamas and jeans also they have christmas blanket are they happy yes they are it is christmas night okay that is good very good okay do you know what is a blanket no okay it is like the this it's a Christmas blanket. Ah, uh, eat that. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Any else? Another word that you don't know? Do you know all of them? Yes, okay, that was good. Very good. Oh, okay. Someone else who wants to practice? Do you want to practice? No? Okay. So what you are going to do now Based on that picture that you can see there, okay, basado en, en la imagen, you can see all the activities that they are doing, right? So you're going to write, um, you no, I mean, the conversation, if, if you want, you can do a conversation or if you want, you can do a paragraph. You can write a paragraph uh, using the following words in the present continuous, reading, because he is reading, okay, watching, because he is using a tablet, painting, because she is painting, and caring, because she is carrying a baby. So those are the the verbs that you are going to use, but you can use more, okay? Pueden usar más. But we're going to... You decide if you want to do a, a conversation or just a paragraph based on that picture. You have uh, five minutes 
and only you can write that. So you can write four sentences or more. Okay, cuatro, una con cada verbo o más, if you want. And then I will ask you to read that for me. Teacher. Yes. Tenemos, tenemos que utilizar los cuatro verbos para hacer esa. Sí. O solo un verbo. No, los cuatro. Es que van a, van a hacer. Ustedes eligen. Pueden hacer una conversación o pueden hacer un párrafo. Como el primer párrafo que vimos. ¿Se acuerdan? Este. Ah, okay. Lo único que lo van a hacer utilizando estos verbos. Okay, si usted teacher. quiere, puede hacer una, una, una conversación o un párrafo, lo que usted quiera. Okay, eh, okay. Y van a utilizar los verbos mínimo, van a escribir cuatro oraciones. Va a incluir un, una, una, un verbo de esos cada oración. Ok. Si usted puede escribir más oraciones, puede hacerlo. Okay. Okay, teacher. Thank you. Eso es para ahorita, teacher. Yes. Les su, u, recuerden, utilizando la estructura de present continuous, ¿ok? You can, for example, you can say, okay, in this beautiful house, there is a family. Um, they have three children, okay? Um, for example, you can say, um, let me see, Vinicio, okay, you can name the, the, the people that you can see there. Vinicio is reading the newspapers, okay. Um, then the little baby is, who can see? Okay, the little baby is uh, Oscar. Okay. Um, his mother is Rocio. <laughs> She's carrying <laughs> the, the baby. Okay. Um, and then the, we have a little girl. Her name is uh, Crisia. Okay, she's painting. She's painting. She, or, um, and also we have, uh, you can say, let me see. Ya tenemos otro niño acá. Well, the boy is 10 years old. His name is uh, Alex. He's watching videos in his tablet. They have a dog. The dog name is... Um, I don't know, you can say you can say the name of the, your dog, okay? 
just ideas for you, but you are free to use your creativity. You can, you can use your imagination. Pueden usar su imaginación, okay? Imaginarse. You, that is a happy family. Pueden, pueden inventar los nombres de ellos. Maybe they are in a, a, a weekend. They are in, in the house and the activities that they are doing. Echen una pregunta. Uh -huh. Dice que yo no, todavía tengo mis dudas ahí. ¿Usted quiere que hagamos cuatro oraciones utilizando de cuatro oraciones, cuatro oraciones que incluyan los verbos, verdad? Correcto. Los verbos que están ahí. Pero uh -huh. la oración tiene que ir descrita en base a las figuritas que estamos viendo de, de las personas. Y Correcto. Uh -huh. Después. Correcto, sí. Ah, ok. Es que no, no lo he entendido. Como, como la, la idea, pues, porque así en inglés no lo entiendo todo, Tuche. Tiene, tiene que traducir al Spanish algunas cosas. <risa> ah, ok, ok. Ah, no, sí, si basa, basados en la imagen y basado, eh, basada en la imagen, yo les he dado los verbos de, lo, de las actividades que ellos están haciendo. Por ejemplo, he is reading the newspaper, ok. Uh -huh. She is painting. She, I mean, he is uh, playing or, or watching a video on the on the tablet, and she is carrying her baby. Y teacher, y Kerry, que es cariñoso, que porque lo busqué aquí, nada que ver con eso. En el en el diccionario de Google me aparece otra cosa. Eh. Mm, okay, es cargar. Pero ya se lo busco, permítame. Okay. Um, ¿Puede ver mi, mi diccionario en la pantalla? Sí. Okay. Carry is to hold. Okay. Tener algo or someone with your hands. Cargar algo en sus manos. Algo o alguien. En este caso es el bebé. Ah, pero como ahí, ahí está en gerundio, está en ING, ya cambia la acción. Uh -huh. Pero ese es el verbo normal. Ese es en, ajá, en verbo normal. Ay, yo no estoy en clase. No, allí. Yo, ahorita no, yo no. <risa> Mejor la pongo en mute. <risa> <risa> bueno, hoy sí ya, ya, ya le entendí ahí que es la, de, la, la señora cargando el bebé, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Correct. That is correct. Yes? 
y no se pueden otros verbos, solo eso tienen que ser. No, usted puede usar más, pero ah, esos, vale, son, vale. esos son los principales. Ah, vale, vale. Teacher dijo que podían ser oraciones, ¿verdad? Sí, puede ser oraciones como un pequeño párrafo o puede ser un diálogo, como usted, como usted lo sienta más fácil. Yo hice oraciones ya, teacher. Ok. Let me know when you are ready. Leo. Mildred. Esperamos. Okay, Mildred, go ahead. Ah, okay. Sebastiana is reading the book. Okay. Vinicio is watching TV. My daughter is by painting in your notebook. In her notebook. Yeah. I am. Ah, yes, in her notebook, gracias. In her. I am carrying my baby. I'm carrying my baby, okay. Well, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, Lucia? Ah. Hice un pequeñito diálogo. Okay. El contexto es de que el vecino llega a preguntar a la familia. Hi, neighbor. What are you doing? Hi. My husband is ready. Robert is watching his TV. Maggie is painting her homework. And I am carrying of my baby. I carry my baby. Okay. Very good. Thank you so much. That was good, Lucia. Okay, Cindy. I see the paragraph. Okay. There is a family in the picture, formed by four people. Two of them are children. The little girl is painted a picture. And the little boy is watching a video in his tablet. They are sitting on the grass. Then there is a dad. He's reading the newspaper. And there is a mom that she's carrying her little baby. And the little baby is smiling because he's with his mom. And the dog is resting on the grass next to the little girl. Wow. Okay, that was excellent. Very good. Thank you so much, Cindy. Okay, I like it. Okay, who else is ready? Okay, Mirna, Jasmine. Okay. The, fam the family Robinson. The, their father is reading newspaper. The son is watching the pictures in the tablet. His daughter is painting a world of art. The mother is carrying a baby. Okay, pictures. 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 Mm -hmm. okay. okay, very good. Thank you so much. Okay, Ursula. Okay. Hello, it's Adrian. This is my family. My father is reading a newspaper. My brother Carlos is watching her phone. Mary is painting. And my mother Maritza is caring to my little brother. Okay, that was excellent. Thank you so much. Wendy Lisette. 
Dad is reading the daily news newspaper. Amy is painting what she likes the most. Victor is watching educational videos on the table. On the table. On the table. My Tablet. mom is. Tablet. My mom is carrying my little brother. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, very good. Wendy? Okay, who else? A ver. Sebastiana? Vinicio? Sí, aquí estoy. Tenemos Bien, varios que faltan. Ole. Ok. Ajá, ¿qué pasa, Sebastiana? Ok. <laughs> Thanks, Vinicio. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, I read a paragraph. They are my neighbors. They are Lemus family. He is Alberto Lemus. He is reading the newspaper. And um, she is Lucia with her son Federico. She is carrying his baby. Also, they have a daughter and a son more. Mm, the girl uh, is Valeria. Valeria is painting a picture about her dolls and the boy is watching his tablet. They have a pet. Uh, it is a dog. It is in them. Uh, its name is the prince and they are a happy family. Okay, that was good. Very good. Sebastiana, thank you so much. Okay. Okay. Um, Rocio, just me. What about you? Uh, Miguel is reading the news. Raquel is care, uh, carrying her cute baby. Uh, and uh, Angel is watching the tablet. Rebecca is painting her dough in her notebook. Uh, they are a happy family. Okay, excellent. Thank you so much. Oscar mm -hmm. Otoniel? Are you there, Oscar? Oscar? Okay. Me dejó la me dejó el, el, la cámara encendida y se fue Oscar. Ok, Mayra, Xiomara. Mayra. A ver si anda en el baño, Tich. Tich, mire, yo la hice, pero así como la compañera que acaba de pasar, yo, yo hice una oración poniendo el verbo, pero describiendo lo que estoy viendo ahí de las imágenes. Es ¿no? ok. Es ok, Benito. Si uh -huh. es así, se la digo, pero es lo que yo veo ahí de los dibujitos. Es pues. ok, go ahead. Está bien. Vale. Yes. Yo le puse, va, son cinco hechos, usando los verbos que dice. Dice, is father reading the newspaper. La dos dice, is mother carrying the child. La tres dice, is boy watching in the tablet. La cuatro, is sister painting in the park. Y la cinco is it's playing dogs. Dog. Hasta el perrito nombre. Ok. Ok. Um, pero en, ese ca en estos casos quizás solo le faltaría como por ejemplo my sister is doing, uh -huh, is painting. Ok. Um, Porque siento como que le falta algo al principio, las oraciones, ¿ok? Como usted dijo que en presente continuo, que no tendría que empezar con, con el verbo to be primero. Mm. No necesariamente. No, no, no necesariamente, porque entonces sería pregunta si usted empieza con el verbo to be. Ah, ok. Entonces sería una... Una conversación normal. Una oración uh, en ajá, normal, o sea, en tiempo... So, 
una oración positiva o puede ser negativa, depende el, dependiendo del contexto en el que usted lo vea. Okay, for, for example, my sister, digamos que yo estoy hablando que, que yo soy parte de esa familia, entonces puedo decir, my sister, okay, is painting, ok. Oh, sí. uh -huh. Ese día de cambiarlo, ¿verdad? Sí, solamente eso, porque siento como que le falta algo al inicio de la oración. Sí, es que se ve como que son preguntas y no, es una, así una conversación así normal, descripción es... normal, digamos. Son oraciones, ajá, oraciones acerca de lo que usted ve en la imagen. Ah, oh, ok. Después mm -hmm. lo voy a cambiar. Ok. Mara, Xiomara, ¿estás you ready? Sí, yo igual hice tipo oraciones porque oh. como me, me desconecté y cuando me conecté solo medio entendí que estaban haciendo algo de la imagen. Yes, it's ok, it's ok. The sentence is ok. Go ahead. Ok. The party is reading the new paper. The boy is watching tablet. The mother is carrying the baby. Mm -hmm. The little girl is fighting and playing dog. Painting, you mean? Painting. 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 The little girl is painting and playing dog. Okay. We are a beautiful family. They are a beautiful family. Okay. Thank you so much, Mayra. Okay. Uh, Wendy Gabriela. In the afternoon, the family Sanchez are doing different activities. Marta is is carrying her baby in the house. Pablo is reading newspaper. Juancito is watching videos of YouTube. Marianita is painting. They are a happy family. Okay, that was good, Wendy. Very good. Okay. Buena imaginación. Um, okay, let me see. <clears throat> Lucia Lucía ya pasó, ok. Ok, ya tenemos Mildred, Lucía, Cindy, Úrsula, Mirna, pero no recuerdo cuál Mirna. Eh, eh, Mirna, yo, Mirna Lisa, Mirna y Yasmin pasó ya. Mirna Lisa, le voy a dar y para lo voy a decir. Okay, go ahead, Mina. Uh, my son is laying on the bed. My husband is working. My mother in lay is washing the dishes. I am looking at the computer. My little son is reading a story. Reading? A story. Story, okay. Thank you so much. You did it about your family. It's okay. Okay. Uh, Reina Calles. Reina. Uh, Ready? Uh, good night, teacher. Good night. Um, bueno, traté de hacer algo, pero no sé. Yo te lo voy a leer así como lo, lo traté de ubicar. Okay. Uh, dice... Um, History diary de my family. Um, it is my house. Uh, in city is at uh, my father, Vinicio. He is reading. He is reading newspaper. My mother Margaret may washing in laundry. And my sister, Kathy, is fighting a dog. Um, my brother, Charlie, uh, is playing ballon soccer. My grandmother, crying, uh, el verbo carrying. 
Karen. 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 Uh -huh. uh, my grandmother. My grandmother carrying a, her baby little. Little, little y, baby. Little baby. <laughs> Little baby, um, uh, uh, mini, a uh, mini, uh, noticing, photography, photography, es decir, sostiene una fotografía. Y al final, in short, my family is wonder, wonderful, hard, hard work, working, es decir, mi familia pasa ocupada. Trabajando. Ok, well, you have the ideas, ok, tiene las ideas, pero necesitamos como reordenar bien esas ideas, ok. Sí. Uh, ok, and also, et, et, también necesitamos eh, repasar un poquito la pronunciación de los verbos, ok. Try to practice, for example, uh, painting. Okay, playing, playing, doing laundry. Es el verbo que, que utilizaría, okay? My mom is doing laundry. Uh, uh, my mother no era make. Mm, no, en este caso doing laundry. Para, para, para esa actividad siempre vamos a utilizar el do, okay? Do laundry. Or do the dishes. Do washing, laundry. Mm, ya no voy a utilizar el, el washing. Va a utilizar solo do, doing laundry. Doing laundry. Mm -hmm. Ok. Mm -hmm. Sí, ok. Ok, y tratemos de, de uh, reestructurar un poquito más el párrafo. El párrafo. But you are doing a, a good job, ok? You are trying. Okay, teacher. Ok, Reina. Sí. Bueno, por motivo del tiempo, los demás uh, les, lo van a hacer para ustedes mismos porque ya no les quiero quitar más tiempo, ok? Um, just I will take the attendance, solo voy a pasar lista. Y aquí les traía otro verbos. Ok, celebrate, take, create, design, think. Imagine, innovate. Okay. Okay. Ah, uh, do you have questions? Tienen preguntas? Teacher, disculpe, puede volver a colocar los verbos. Okay. Teacher, mire, yo un comentario eh, que le iba, le iba a decir lo siguiente. ¿no? Lo que pasa es que usted tiene un material diferente al de nosotros, al menos el que está en la plataforma. Hay unas cuestiones que usted nos ha explicado que el material que uno bajó no las tiene. Es, es como que el suyo es bien amplio, pues están todos esos verbos y todo no aparecen aquí en este que, que uno descargó. No es que, Vinicio, eh, por eso mismo yo trato de ampliarles un poquito más el contenido, porque... Eh, el que ustedes tienen puede ser que para algunos sea limitado. Entonces yo trato de traerles más verbos, um, en este caso más actividades para que ustedes aprendieran más vocabulario. Pero sí. está relacionado con lo mismo, ¿ok? Ajá, no, yo me refería a que este, este material que usted nos no explica no está disponible para nosotros, así, sino que es, es algo que usted ha hecho más amplio, pero de su iniciativa, no de Insafor. Correcto. Los ah. maestros somos libres de, de, de ampliar el contenido. Obviamente no, no, o sea, no pasándonos a otro tema, sino continuando con los mismos temas que están en la plataforma, pero podemos ampliar el contenido un poquito, como ah. darles más vocabulario. Correcto. Es que a eso me refería, que usted, en el que usted nos muestra está más explicado que el, que el que uno bajó, pues está, siento que ese está un poco más corto comparado con lo que usted nos va explicando. O sea, en conclusión, siento que está mejor eso. Pues. Ok. Ok. Si les funciona, yo les, les mando la presentación. Ok. 
Sí, en el caso mío me gustaría para imprimirlo y tenerlo ahí repasado. Ok, I will do it. Let me take the attendance. Uh, Kenia Denise. Crisia. Crisia. Lorena Guadalupe. Ahora sí me asistieron bien poquitos. Lucía. Present. María José Salidas. Marvin David de Paz. Ok. Mayra Xiomara. Present. Mildred. Present. Mirna Elizabeth. Tonto. Mirna Yasmín. Present. Oscar. Present. Oscar lo estaba llamando ya ratitos, pero andaba ausente usted. <laughs> okay. I am work. Sorry. Okay. Reina Jael. A mí me faltó Reina. Reina Margarita. Presente. Reina. Enrita. Roberto Valmore. Tampoco. Rocío Yasmín. Present. Roxana Elizabeth. Roxana. Sebastiana. Present. Cindy. Here. Sonia. Jocelinda. Stephanie Michelle. Úrsula. Present. Verónica Patricia. Vicente. Vinicio. Vicente. Wendy. Gabriela. Present. Wendy Lisset. Present. William Alfredo. And Jancy Carolina. Present. Okay, thank you. Very good. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay, for your attendance and participation. Gracias por su asistencia y por haber participado. Okay. Les agradezco mucho. It was a pleasure for me be be part of your learning process okay eh, yo sé que algunos de ustedes eh, saben mucho y para los que aún les falta siempre motivarles okay que sigan eh, no no se den por vencidos ustedes pueden okay eh, podemos alcanzar todos los sueños que nos propongamos, no importa que tan difícil sea, pero el sacrificio que se hace día con día es como una piedrita que usted va poniendo, ok, a construir un castillo, digamos, ok, ese sacrificio que se hace día con día, eso es lo que vale la pena, es lo que cuenta. Siempre les motivo a que sigan adelante y espero algún día encontrármelos otra vez. Claro. Y pasé el grado o no, teacher. <ríe> claro que sí. <ríe> pasé el grado, dice. Quería escuchar a ver qué decía usted. Teacher, <ríe> okay. gracias, gracias por todo. Por todo. Gracias okay. por todo. Sí, gracias por su paciencia. <ríe> Para eso estamos. Pida que, nos, pida que nos dé usted el otro, el otro, el otro ciclo, le iba a decir ya. El otro nivel. El otro wow. nivel. Ah, bueno. bueno Yo no, no, no puedo hacer mucho. A veces, a, a veces se lo puede, vuelven a asignar el mismo grupo que uno ha tenido, pero en este caso, como les digo, ya me, me llamaron y me dijeron que sí. Si, que si me estaba de acuerdo a, a cambiarme al grupo de dos horas. Y bueno, <ríe> yo dije que sí. No hubiera decidido eso, Ticha. No, no, no lo hubiera decidido, ¿verdad? Usted no tenía que consultar primero, Ticha. Sí. 
¿Quiénes están de acuerdo que me quede? Me <risa> ok. Sí, bueno, bueno, y a partir del lunes ya vamos entonces con otro teacher en el otro nivel. Supongo que les van a avisar, no sé si a partir del lunes o les van a dar vacaciones, porque sería la semana, semana Santa es de vacación. Yo creo, si no me equivoco, que les van a dar libre dos semanas esta y Semana Santa y luego ya van a iniciar el otro nivel. Uh -huh. Creo, si no me equivoco, pero no, no estoy segura. Nos avisaron antes, como tres días antes de, de que cuando iba a comenzar este, este que estamos terminando y hasta ahorita no han avisado nada. Uh -huh. Por eso les digo que creo que eso va a pasar. Pero igual ustedes no se desanimen, eh, siempre estudien ustedes solitos, ¿ok? Eh, a pónganse. A disfrutar el descanso. <risa> Vinicio, pero... Hacer aunque... ejercicio, acuérdese, hablamos de ir a hacer ejercicio. <risa> ok, sí. Ah. Teacher, esta es la última clase entonces. Mañana ya no. Por este módulo sí, sí, hoy es jueves, ya la última clase del módulo 1. Gracias por todo. Gracias a nuestro compañero. Ok. Happy weekend. Take care. Bye, teacher. Bye. 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 Thank you so much. Gracias, teacher. Bye. Gracias. Bye. Good night. Take care. Gracias por todo, teacher. Good night. Gracias por todo. Good night, teacher. Good night. Bueno, gracias. Igual. Ni nos queremos salir, Tite. Ah, no. Entonces... <risa> Bye, guys. Take Bye. care. Bye. Gracias por todo. Teacher. Bye, teacher. Thanks a lot. Nice to meet you. For everything. Bye.